This is the sparkling actress and bright television game-playing star, Arlene Francis. Thank you. And this is my partner, Susan Shine from Bronx, New York. This is the fine actor, popular Broadway and television star, Larry Blyden. Hello. This is my partner, Randy Charlton from Wilton, Connecticut, and we're all here to play Password. Now, here's your host on Password, Alan Ludden. Good afternoon. Thank you. Good to have you with us. Uh, how are you, Arlene? Good to see you. Hello, Larry. Hi. Arlene, you're going out on the lecture platform, huh? Well, I'm not really going out on many. I'm just going to go to Dayton, Ohio, and try it and see if it works. Where are you going to lecture in? When are you going to lecture in Dayton? The uh, 20th of April and the 21st. I'm going to do two days. Well, good. In Dayton, Ohio. Yes. Good. Aren't you going to lecture somewhere? Yep. I'm going, in to, lec Ohio? I'm going to lecture in Iowa at oh. Parsons College on the 21st, and in Darrow Haute, Indiana on the 22nd, and in Duluth on the 28th. Oh, well, you're a harder worker than I am. Well, that's just three. You have two. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you. Hello, Sue. Hello, Alan. Let's see. What do you do in a Foreign Policy Association? I'm an assistant in regional development and educational planning. Well, good. Nice to have you here. Sounds now, in the apple tree, every night on Broadway, that delightful musical, you play a character, the same character in three plays, right? Yes, I play the devil, and you recognize me immediately because I have a little red handkerchief. That's how you look like the devil. That's how you know that's who I am. If I lose that handkerchief, the whole thing goes. Yes. You never look like the devil. No. He always looks good. Yeah, he's, a, he's the most delightful devil you'll ever see in a delightful musical, The Apple Tree. It is a good show. Really sure. Is. Randy, how are you? Let's see, Very you're a good. medical you. student. What area of medicine do you intend to practice in? Right now, I'm interested in becoming a psychiatrist. Well, good. Don't, Don't leave me. <laughs> <laughs> Stick around. We'll play Password in just a moment, but right now, let's watch this. All right, Arlene, let's start. We have the ladies now competing against the gentlemen. Larry and Arlene have the word. We'd like you to have it at home. The password is fellow. Ten points, Arlene. See if you can get Sue Shine to say that. Check. Say it again, Fella. please. Fellow. Fellow. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, you didn't have to. Check. Fellow. Got it. The ladies have ten points, men. You start, Randy, this time. There you go, Sue. Thank you. As they look at it. The password is chum. Ten points, Randy. Fellow? Chap. Chap. No. <laughs> ah, that's what I would have said, though. Nine points. <laughs> Pal. Pal. Eight points, Randy. Friend. Chum. Yes. Chum. Well, you're starting off pretty fast today. Eight for the men, ten for the ladies. The word goes back to Arlene and Larry, and as they look at it... The password is shrine. Ten points, Arlene. Give you twenty. Grotto. Blue. Grotto blue? The blue grotto. Oh. Nine points, Larry. Bernadette. Bernadette. Cave? Bernadette Cave. No. <laughs> eight points. Give you 18, Arlene. Um. Um. Five seconds. Prayer. Vigil. Vigil. Seven points, Larry. Alter. Say it again, Larry. Please. Alter. Altar. Alter. Five seconds, Landy. Podium. No, six points, Arlene. Um, holy. Cloister. Cloister. Five points, Larry. Memorial. Catacomb? Catacomb. Uh. Oh, you were so sure. I'm sorry, Randy. Four points, Arlene. Sacred. Five seconds, Sue. There goes your time. All right, three points, Larry. Uh, edifice. Five seconds, Randy. Statue. Nope, two points, Arlene. Shine. <laughs> uh, 
five seconds. <laughs> moon. 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 One point, Larry. Fez. Oh, good. Fez. Very. Five good. seconds, Randy. Hat. Hat. No, the men who wear the fez hats are Shriners, and the word is shrine. Hard word. Yes, very difficult word. Interesting play. Good clues. Good response. You know, it's kind of fun in this game just to watch you think. And believe me, Sue and Randy were thinking. Washington. You what? National Shrine of Washington? You were National. The you said national. But it, well, well, we, well, we do another. Yeah, you get you get okay. the same word again. You get you get a new word. Same people. Oh yeah. The password is chin. Ten points, Arlene. <laughs> Beard. Grubby. Grubby. No. <laughs> Nine points, Larry. Um, uh, Five seconds. Point. Goatee. Goatee? Eight points, Arlene. Dimpled chin. Yes. <laughs> I almost said chin. You almost said chin? I was thinking about it. You said dimple, I was thinking it was left. We'll continue playing Password in just a moment, but right now, here's a message. 18 to 8. Randy, you have 8. Sue, you have 18. You can win on that. And as they look at it. The password is voltage. 10 points. Randy will tie the score. Amperage. Volts. Roughly a form of the word. You said volts. voltage. That's it. There you go. Good. Good going. Well, you're very electrical. Oh, we're even. Now look at the score. Either team can win. The password is crunch. Oh, Look at it carefully. Ten points. Give you the game, Arlene. Nutty. <laughs> Nutty. Five seconds, Sue. <laughs> wacky. Nutty oh. wacky. <laughs> I'm so mad. <laughs> well, you just overacted a little there. I went too far. All right. Nine points, Larry. I'll give you the game. Munch. Crunch. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Munch was a great play. Yes, you were crunching over so there, and he sorry. was munching. Yeah, it's quite all right. I think it's fair. Though. All right. Randy, you won $100, a chance to win $250 in the lightning round. You ready to go, Larry? Ready. One minute. First word, go. Shave. Razor. Yes. Here. Listen. Yes. Uh, sleep. Wake. Um, less. Dream. Um, lie. Bed. Unwind. Relax. Yes. Bird. Cage. Song. Uh, parrot. Game. Love bird. Fun. Happiness. Uh, <laughs> park. <laughs> Park. Love. Uh, close. <laughs> <laughs> Sex. Love. Far. Next word. <laughs> Next word. Mouse. Right. Yes. Yeah. You don't miss it. I tell you, you better get our psychiatrist off of that word. <laughs> our psychiatrist, psychiatrist had a one-track mind there. The bird was lark we were talking about. Just a cigarette. Yes, like that. <laughs> Randy has won $300, Sue has won $300, and we thank you both for playing fast with us. Very good. All right, delightful players. Let's meet two more password players, shall we? Arlene Francis, meet your new partner from Elkins Park, Pennsylvania, Edward Shaw. Hello, Ed. Larry Blyden, meet your new partner from New York City, Margie Wall. Hello, Margie. Ed, what do you do for a living? I'm district manager for a company manufacturing high-intensity lamps. Well, good to have you here. Marjorie Wall, I know you're married. Do you have a family? Yes, I have four daughters. Barbara's 20, Valerie's 12, <laughs> Kimberly's 7, and Shane is 3. Well, you didn't forget anybody. You got them all in. All right, let's play the game, shall we? Arlene, you start. There you go, Larry. Friend. The password is bore. Ten points, Arlene. Uh... Five seconds. Drear. Drear. Five seconds, Ed. 
Sad. Sad. Nine points, Larry. Dull. Boring. Roughly a form of the word. You said boring. Boar. That's it. Hi. <laughs> Very good. Nine to nothing. We'll return to password in just a moment, right after this message. And now, back to password and Alan Ludden. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. We're playing Pastor this week with one of my favorite actresses and one of the most delightful people in television who's going to be lecturing in Dayton, Ohio next week, Miss Arlene Francis. Thank you. The young man who's starring on Broadway in a delightful musical called The Apple Tree, Mr. Larry Blyden. Ed, Marjorie, the score is nine to nothing. You start, Ed. There you go, Marjorie. As they look at it, we'd like you to see it. The password is percolator. Ten points, Ed. Boiler. Heater? Heater. Nine points, Margie. Coffee. Uh, percolator? Yes. You know, for a first clue, Boiler was very good, though, Ed. It, it, uh, it may have set it up for them, but it, it was something of a... It didn't set it up for me. No. Well, it's a little harder. <laughs> it helped me a lot. Yeah. <laughs> We'd like you to see it. The password is forgive. Now, Arlene. Pardon. Excuse. Excuse. Nine points will give you the game, Larry. Uh, forget. Forgive. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, very fast. You did that in three words. Yes, you did. Yes, very, very good. Margie, you won $100 and a chance to win 300, 250 in the lightning round. 350 all together if you get them all. You ready? In one minute, here's the first word. Go. Hand. Feet. Heart. Fingers. Yes. Uh, pickle. Deal. Original. Cucumber. That's it. Uh, worst. Bad. Opposite. Good. Better. Remarkable. Finest. Uh, great. Goodest. <laughs> Best. Yes. Sword. Uh, dagger. Military. Uh, Pirates. Um. Say anything, Margie. Um. Uh, sword. Uh. 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 Foil. Oh. Uh, uh, spoil. New word. New word. Uh. Lipstick. Rouge. Yes. <laughs> Lipstick rouge. How'd you get that so? That's a difficult lightning round word, Margie. Saber was the kind of sword he was going for, but Margie Wall has won three hundred dollars. Ed Shaw, you may still win some money. Change partners if they take the game. Margie. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Military. Well, Sabre, as I say, is a difficult lightning round word. All right, we have the ladies now competing against the gentlemen. You all set? Yep. You start, Larry, so there's the word. Arlene? The password right. is gurgle. Ten points, Larry. <laughs> Gargle. Throat. Throat. Nine points, Arlene. Baby gurgle. Yeah. <laughs> You've had the babies, and you know they gurgle. All right. Well, that's... Hey, you're playing that very well. Watch out, Ed. She's a demon over here. There you go, Margie. The password is wash. Ten points, Ed. Scrub. Clean. Clean. Nine points give you 18, Margie. Linen. Linen. Five seconds, Arlene. Uh, launder? No. Eight points, Ed. Bathe. Five seconds, Larry. Uh, soap? Soap. Seven points, Margie. Weekly? Wash. Wash. Ah. I thought it was before. I showed you. You thought it was win? I thought it was 
cold, but when he said scrub, I thought it must be something special. You do, not just wash. <laughs> just plain old wash. 16 for the ladies. Watch out, men. They can win on this. I think they're getting messages from each other over there. <laughs> That's the way you play the game. The password is drape. Ten points, Larry. Oh. Curtains. Draperies. You said rough, you said draperies. You give me a form of the, you've given us a form of the word. One chance to give me the precise word. Drapes. That's it. I'll take the pair. Come to 16. We'll return in a moment, but right now, here's a word. 16 for the ladies. They can win on this, Margie. Good luck. You can keep her from winning, Ed. Good luck to you as they look at it. The password is page. 10 points, Margie. Book. Book. Read. Read. Nine points. Give you 19, Ed. Leaf. Page. Yes. <laughs> now what do we have? 19 to 16. Either team can oh. win. You have the first shot at it, it's Arlene. A fight. There you go. You can win on that. You can win on that. We'd like you to see it. The password is steep. 10 points, Arlene. Give you the game. Slope. Mountain. Mountain. Nine points give you the game, Larry. Sharp. Five seconds, Ed. Cliff. Cliff. Eight points give you 24, Arlene. Um. Um. Five. Simmer. Five seconds. Point. Point. Seven points, Ed. Give you the game. I mean, Larry. Brew. Five seconds, Ed. Okay. Six points, Arlene. Church. Steeple. Five points, Larry. You don't say that. Uh. Five seconds. Give you 24. Angle. Steep. Steep. Mm. <laughs> steeple is not a form of the word steep. They're two different steeple. words. It contains the word, but I can't take steep as a, as a form of steeple. You would have been a little thrown if I'd asked well, you to. Do you know that the origin of steeple is from the word steep? Because you see, it's at the top of the church, and it's a very sharp incline down. So Thank it's you, it's very Art. steep. You've been with John <laughs> Daly too long. All right. John would be proud of you. 16, you can win on that, Margie. Ed, you can win on that. And as they look at it, we'd like you to see it. The password is doodle. 10 points, Margie, give you the game. Aimlessly wandering. Wandering. Nine points, give you the game, Ed. Scribble. Scrawling. Scrawling. Eight points. Give you 24. Tie the score, Margie. Telephone. Telephone. Uh, Five seconds. Um, uh, static. Static. No. Seven points. Give the game, Ed. Draw. Doodle. Doodle. Yeah. Doodle. Well, that was a difficult word. Aimlessly scrawling at the telephone. That must be where you do all your doodling, huh, Margie? Yeah. All right. Ten points. Uh, uh, we won the game. Telephone drawing. Yes. <laughs> and you've doodled a lot in your time, haven't you, Larry? Yes, I'm an inveterate doodler. You are. Yes. Well, I knew that about you. You ready to go, Ed? You've won a hundred dollars. You can play the lightning round now for two hundred and fifty, Larry. In one minute. Here's the first word. Go. Uh, chew. Drink. Swallow. Eat. Yes. Morning, evening, wetness, dew. Yes. Hand, foot, clenched, fist. Right. Dollar, cents. Uh, owing, debt. Uh, paper, loan. Uh, name, bill. Yes. Tail, wag. Uh, story, poem, Aesop. Fable. Right. Very good. You play this lightning round very in a very orderly fashion, Larry. Very good. And that is one three hundred and fifty dollars. Margie, we have three hundred dollars for you, and we'll return in a moment. But first, here's a message for you.
Margie, Ed, I know I'm speaking for my friends at home when I tell you that a game like this last one, which was close, well played, and except for that very one, that, that very narrow slip there, you, you never knew who was going to win. It's the kind of, way, kind of way we like to see Password played, and thank you for playing with us. You've done a very good job. Arlene, you'll be back tomorrow. Even though I wasn't very good today, I'll You were very chance. good. You can't always win. It's how no. you play the game, as they always say. <laughs> That's what they always say, isn't it? They always say that. You'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. like, of course, to see you tomorrow. Until then, this is Alan Ludden saying the password today is today. Anyone you know in the service will appreciate the thoughtfulness of a letter. So how about writing today? So long. See you tomorrow, I hope. These, are our These four words can change your life forever. Deal. Or no deal. The models, the money, the make or break moments. You have no idea, people, no idea. No. It's Deal or No Deal on GSN, hosted by Howie Mandel. You will love him. He is so much fun. Deal or No Deal, tomorrow, 7 p.m., 6 central on GSN.